Hello everyone, welcome to this new Genius Panda tutorial. Today we're gonna learn how to create openings in walls in three different ways. So let's dive in. The first way is editing the wall profile. It's actually very simple. All I have to do is to select the wall and then draw whatever shape I would like. The good thing about this tool that I can create whatever shape I like and it's very easy to use not uh, I think it's the easiest And definitely when I would like to reset, all I have to do is to select the wall once more and click the reset profile button. For our second way, it's actually the quickest way, which is creating wall openings. Uh, from the main architectural bar, the opening panel, I can choose wall opening. Uh, this way I would consider it the the quickest way also I can just manipulate the line work of the opening showing that it's hidden it's actually very good to create uh, wall openings for lobbies places where I don't want to put doors but I don't I want to put some opening I can uh, manipulate it uh, with grips I can see the the design grip right I don't have to edit anything And finally, the second way is the create family or create or model in place avoid and cut it from the wall. I think this tool works best when I would, would like to create some recesses for example because the two other ways I cannot create like recess all I, ha all I can do is opening a full width opening so this way is really cool also I can create any shape I don't have to stick with rectangular shapes So these are our three ways to create openings in walls. Tell me what uh, is your favorite way. And if there is any ways related to this topic, I would like you to share it with us in the comments. And uh, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share this episode with your friends and all the interested people in BIM.
Thank you and see you next time.